Hey YouTube, so I'm going to show you how to fly in Sony Vegas 9. Um, you can do this with 7 or 8, but I'm going to show you how to do it in Sony Vegas 9 Pro. Um, I made this tutorial about a year ago, but I erased it, so I guess now I'll redo it. Start off, get your clip, you're going to need a video of you, let me find it, jumping. As high as you can in the air, and my boxers are exposed. Anyway, you're going to need that. And you are going to need a video of just nothing. Don't change the camera angle or anything, just wherever you're about to jump, film it for a few seconds and don't be in it. Alright, so I'm going to cut that away so it's the one thing. I'm going to trim this up to where I want to put it. Trim it up again. Alright, anyway, find the point where you're highest in the air using the arrow keys to skip frame by frame. I'm going to stop it right there. Now I'm going to press U on this clip to separate the audio. I'm going to insert a new video track. I'm going to drag that on top. So now it looks like... I know it was laggy. I'm going to erase the audio completely. Okay, anyway, um, ignore this part. Okay, so you can see I'm jumping as high as I can into the air. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to take that last frame, I'm going to take a snapshot of it, I'm going to save it as a PNG, and give it a minute and it will automatically get imported in a Vegas, there it is. Just get that last keyframe off, drag the image in, zoom in to that image, or you drag it in. I go to mask and mask out the body. I'm gonna do a very crappy job of this just to make your part easier. Uh, that's awful. Anyway, keep going, blah blah blah. I'm not even gonna bother with my belt. I wanna while my arm is way out there. Okay, now it looks like that. You can feather it if you want, I'm not going to bother with it. Go to event, hand slash crop again, go to position. First keyframe, bring about right. Yeah, no, go up. Right there. Two more keyframes. Just keep messing with it until you get something you like. See, I messed up with the mask real quick, but I'm not going to worry about it. Now I'm going to go to Gaussian Blur. Bring the horizontal all the way down. I'm going to leave that. At the very end, I'm going to drag it all the way up. So, bam, bam. Okay, another thing you can do to give it a better look is when you bend down, the jump, right, right when you're extending upwards, split the clip. Fast forward it. Um, one thing you can notice with my clips is that lighting changes. But um, it, that won't happen to everyone, so you just gotta hope it's not you. That's pretty much it. If you're able to follow along with that, you deserve a medal. Because. I did a horrible job at explaining this tutorial, so thank you for watching, and um, stay in school.